it seems like the equipment we've purchased or gotten becomes obsolete before, you know, before we get the value out of it. I'm at the stage now where I'm just barely walking. And my concern is I buy this thing, it's supposed to lift me up to my feet off the toilet. Right. But, uh, heck, uh, by the time we get it installed, I'm, in two weeks I may not be walking anymore, you know. I mean, I don't know. That's how this thing is, uh, how this thing is going on. Unfortunately, Sue has no Social Security disability benefits. We get nothing. I get no, in, in the state of Vermont that gives a lot and they have a lot of good benefits, I have no benefits available to me. This is a hell of an expensive disease. We have insurance, but all the other supplements she was taking, I think she, we were spending almost $1,000 a month on medications. That chair, which lifts her up, the middle chair is electric, was $950, insurance doesn't pay it. When Sue loses her voice, Blue Cross will not pay for a machine for her to tell the doctor how she feels. Figure that one out. That wheelchair was $19,000. They paid 80% of it. They would not pay for the ramp to get her out the house. She goes for acupuncture once a week, which is another $50 a week. She feels wonderful after acupuncture. Feels wonderful. That's not insurable. They do pay for the therapy. They pay for part of that. We just pay a copay. You know, I spend three hundred dollars on vitamins, and knowing that they're not going to work, hoping that they'll just slow it down some, but knowing they won't work. I got the prescription, and at that time, my insurance didn't cover anything but generic. So I went to pick it up thinking it would be fairly expensive, you know. And she said that would be $780 or whatever, and I was just like, what? The lady next to me, she was like, what the heck is that stuff? And I said, and it didn't even work. I made a nice living. I've got some savings. Um, we've got some in insurance, we've got the disability insurance that, that I have, we've got the Social Security, so I think financially we're, we're in a sounder position than a lot of people are that have this disease.